Hi everyone, welcome to Organic Chemistry 2 Lab. Um, in this video, I'll walk you through the platform that we need for, uh, for the course. You can access the syllabus from here. This is my contact information. If you, um, if you need any help, just um, give me a call, a text, or an email. Now, in order to uh, purchase the platform, we need the Beyond Labs. And this is the link that you need to go through. In order to do your purchase, go ahead and uh, purchase from here. You can also, by the way, purchase from the bookstore. You can get a code from the bookstore or you can purchase from here directly, whatever is convenient for you. So we're going to hit purchase and then this is the package that we want. The package needs to have organic chemistry in it. After you do the purchase, you're going to receive a code and um, you are going to create a username and password for you, so you, you will be able to log in every single time. Save those username and password so that you can log in automatically. After you log in, you are going to see um, this page over here. So you're going to see this page, and if you haven't used Beyond Labs before, you will not see any groups in there. Nothing. So all what you need to do is uh, hit on groups and hit on a join group. And what I did over here is I sent a code for our class, precisely organic to summer 2024 uh, lab. And it was in the, in, in the uh, welcome email. And this is the code, a lot of numbers. Copy paste it into here and hit save. Okay, so um, once you are, once you want to access any assignment, um, you have two options. Either you go directly to the assignment over here, select your group, make sure that you're working in the right group there. And uh, this is the instructor page. I see everything, all the experiments. But uh, for you guys, you are going to see what is released. Okay. And uh, what is released actually is for now, nothing. You do have the two upcoming labs that um, are going to be activated tomorrow. So you're going to see this and you're going to see that tomorrow that are open. So all what you need to do is just hit on that and work your experiments directly from here and submit your experiment. There will be a separate video that shows you um, how to work these experiments. And uh, that video is, uh, is posted on um, eCampus as well. It's over here, how to use Beyond Labs to answer the worksheet. Please go ahead and 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 watch and watch that. So um, this is going to be the only platform that we will be using for for the lab. If you look at the uh, the syllabus in there, we will have the uh, total of three quizzes, and uh, those three quizzes will be released on these dates. So you have a July 9, you have a July 23, and you have a July 30. And um, the lab due dates are also set over here. Um, you can um, go ahead and check that. And please make sure that you work these quizzes out because the quizzes together with the Beyond Labs uh, worksheet and the lab book, um, these constitute your grade. You don't have a final. So the quizzes are 30% of your grade. Make sure that you do that. Now, if you want an extension, it's uh, it's okay with me, but you just need to let me know. And when I do an extension, I don't do it for a single student. I do it for the whole class. And then I email the class about the extension. This means that the due date is going to change. It won't be reflected um, here in the syllabus. I'm not going to change the syllabus, so it's not going to be reflected in the syllabus. But it should be reflected on the top hat since we are taking the quizzes. Um, actually, no, we are not taking the quizzes on top hat. The quizzes are going to be on eCampus. So um, the due date for these quizzes, the new due date, will be reflected on eCampus as, as well. You are going to see this together with an email sent, sent by me. Um, this is regarding the... Um, uh, the experiments in there. Now, some students are asking me to release all the experiments at once. If I do this, uh, guys, uh, just uh, don't panic. Um, 
uh, I will release all these experiments. So if you go to Beyond Labs, you're going to see all of these experiments that are open for you. Actually, this is easier because you can work at your convenience, but I'm still going to follow the due dates in the syllabus. Okay, I'm still going to follow the due dates in the syllabus, but everything is going to be opened. Um, but I want you not to leave everything till the end because I cannot grade all of those at once. See what I'm saying? So please follow the due date of the syllabus. If I release all the experiments, I'm still expecting you to turn in labs one and two on July the 1st. Um, although everything is going to be opened until, um, I believe, where is that, until August the 2nd, everything is going to be opened until uh, July the, 20, the 29th, actually. Um, but I'm still expecting you to turn in uh, the, those lab reports in there because it's, I cannot grade all of these lab reports at once at the end of the semester, okay? Um, this is regarding the um, what I need to say uh, regarding the, the, the lab. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to email, text, or 